Hello everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Metal Gear Solid 5 The Phantom Pain. So in the last episode we were taken, I guess, prisoner by Skullface and he drove us all the way to the Serac power plant where we met Sahelanthropus. We meet up with the Flame Dude and uh, Psycho Mantis. Looks like they were about to kill us maybe, but then the Flame Dude and Psycho Mantis turned around and I think they took over Sahelanthropus because I think um, I think Psychomantis is controlling Sahelanthropus. There is no way, according to Dr. Emmerich, that Sahelanthropus can walk upright. But, I think I have something special for you guys. So I, I've kind of uh, heard that there's a special scene with Quiet. I have not seen this scene yet, but it has to do with taking a shower. So I'm going to go out into Afghanistan and smoke my cigar for five days and come back and we're gonna see what happens. Apparently this this cutscene can only happen after you finish mission 30. So there must be a lot more missions after this, but I don't know, we'll see. So I'm gonna go out and do a free roam of, uh, let's go to Afghanistan, yeah? All right, uh, six, six days have passed Oh, check it out! You can see flies around Snake. Let me call. There are goats around. The okay. local residents gone. We've gone back to the wild. Support helicopter Roger. requested. So <laughs> we're really stinky. <laughs> check it out. Nice. Okay. So that's step one. You have to beat, or step two, I guess. Step one is beat. Mission 30. Step 2 is to not shower for for 5 or more days. It's been 6 days. And I'm gonna call the chopper and we're gonna head back to Mother Base and uh, a cutscene should arrive, so... Let's see how it goes. I wonder... Hey, quiet. Quiet, do you smell me? Do you smell... There we go. And back to Mother Base! <laughs> We're back on the copter, and the flies have followed us back to our helicopter for some reason. <laughs> quiet, quiet. Do you smell me? Hang on. Let's go back to mother base. to mother base. There we go. We have a cutscene. <laughs> nice work today, boss. <laughs> this is awesome. Welcome back, boss. Yes. Another successful mission. Sig's like, what's going on? <laughs> okay, okay, I'll skip. Safe, boss. Snake, you stink. <clears throat> oh. Okay. That was a cool face. Okay. Oh. Okay. <laughs> I hope this is not too dirty. Wow. <laughs> this is so awkward. <laughs> See, I can, yeah, I can look around. Welcome back. Hmm. Well, snake's all clean, and I don't think he did anything. This was awkward. I hope you guys liked it. Um, we even had people watching us. Thank you for putting an end to the epidemic. A anyway, let's continue on our mission. I'm gonna go take a shower to, just for fun. 
episode 31, Sahelanthropus. Sahelanthropus. Kid going back to some other base? I wonder. Got a spike on the RWR. Strange PRF. What's wrong? Control lost. Can't maintain RPM. We're settling. Is this guy genetically enhanced? I wonder. Kagebunshin. For all you Naruto fans out there. Recovered control. Ascending. Hey, Snake. There's something wrong with Eli. Right, this happened last time in the previous episode. I don't know what was going to happen. Maybe they were going to beat us up. This guy turns around. Looks like he gets run over by the wheels. And um, Skullface gets taken away. But this has to do something with Eli now. Eli and um, Psycho Mantis. Oh yeah, this. Who is doing this? Such a lust for revenge. Who? Snake goes around this corner and it was then, um, okay, Sahelanthropus, or the Metal Gear, yells at us, and that was where we left off. Okay. Yep, that's a helanthropus. It just transformed. It looked like it got a lot bigger. I, I I don't mean it like that, but like it got a lot bigger as in it grew in size as it was transforming. It didn't look that big. But then all had all it did was unfold and it still looks like it gained more material, more metal material, you know? so scary. I don't know what I would do if I was in Snake's position. <laughs> I'd probably run... run far away.
Wow, just like that. Took out a tank. Whoa! No way, it has a sword. That wasn't smart. Oh, I think it rusted up as it was uh, flying, too. TFO. will infest the system! No one can stop it now! Sahalanthropus will unleash that thirst unto the future! Major... Yes. Okay, this looks like um, we're off a cutscene. I have no idea what Skullface is doing. But Snake is very lucky to survive that. Want me to do? Oh! Okay, there's quiet. Quiet's on the scene. I'm gonna maybe do it uh, Kratos style. God of War. Where the heck did it go? I'm gonna mark it.
even know where I am. Kratos! Kratos style! Climb it! Climb it, climb it, climb it, climb it, climb it, climb it! Uh, uh, what am I supposed to do? Oh, oh, oh. Okay. Looks like I'll have to lure it somewhere and then jump on it from the top. From from the top. What was that blue thing? What does that mean? Oh wow. Cease cover. That's fine, that's fine. Go, gotta turn around for these missiles to work. Come on, reload. I'm just gonna sit in this thing until it's done. Got uh, 12 more ammo on this thing. Looks like it shoots six missiles at a time. We're doing all right right now. Moving around. Oh, that thing stopped on a dime. Okay, backing up, backing up, backing up, backing up. One more. Oh wow, this is working! Shoot the crotch! Shoot the crotch! Wow, this is working. Wow! I'm gonna name this thing the crotch shooter. Uh, the controls are so backwards. Crotch. Shoot the head. Uh, okay. Thanks for bothering me. Wow, this is really nice. Doing all right. It's a hell. Ah. Oh. Gotta call in ammo. Please don't bother me. What is this? Just gonna stay behind it, yeah? Best thing to do. Support helicopter. Oh. Okay. 
There we go. Oh, I'm so bloody. Don't kill me. I got you, I got you, I got you. One more, one more, one more. Yeah, we did it! Thanks to the crotch shooter! like the sheep effect. Yeah, take it down. It and its tennis ball shoulder. Pequod. Come get me! <laughs> oh man, Snake looks like he's in bad shape. <laughs> you know what? In the cutscene, they were not sitting in a golden chopper. Snake! Whoa, they looked like they were gonna make out for a second there. Oh, did you guys see those ribs? They were like moving in and out. Oh, nice. Skull face has been pinned down. It might mean we were we're gonna be able to maybe take him hostage or kill him, but he has the disease that um, attacks English. Right now, the diseases don't attack English. This one could potentially like wipe out the planet. Oh, his legs busted. I thought it was higher up. There were three. Where's the other? Very close to you. aiming at the crotch. Oh, it's just like quiet's uh, scene. I can put it, pull the trigger now. Or not. I'm not. He didn't kill me. I am not gonna kill him. Oh, wow. 
wow. This is what Kaz wanted, yeah? <laughs> Kill steal. Now he got all the experience points. Wow, heroism 30,000, skull, hero. Uh, I, I don't know why everybody leveled up. Did I extract a ton of people? Maybe. Oh wow, S rank! Yeah, S rank. And uh, let's see what's gonna happen next. This could be the end of the game. I'm not sure. I don't feel satisfied though. So if it ends here, I'd be kind of disappointed. Actually, the way this game is formatted, it's. I mean, you really don't know who the last boss is, and it turns out to be Skullface, but then they don't really have the satisfaction of fighting him. It's, it's a Halanthropus. And we don't know who the real bad guy is, right? There's gotta be someone else behind, um, what's his name? Psychomantis. feeling of holding a gun that we'll never forget like our lost limbs the sensation lingers phantom pain oh. here she comes here she comes! <laughs> Are they carrying uh, the new spider weapon thing that we've been that's been undergoing development? That's right, we never really completed that thing, huh? Oh! It's a Halanthropus.
What's Amarek doing? Stand tall on missing legs. We stride forward on the bones of our fallen. Then, and only then, are we alive. This pain is ours, and no one else's. The secret weapon we wield, out of sight. We will be stronger than ever, for our peace. Did you guys see Skullface? I wonder what that means. Sahalanthropus will unleash that thirst unto the future. Those were his last words. Cause. <laughs> Pretentious to the end. Still. Doesn't feel like this is over. And I'll never be whole again. There are an estimated 71 or 7100 languages unspoken in the world, but only six are designated as official languages of the United States. Hope you guys read the rest of it. In the deepest night, That's Metal Gear, I guess. Hmm, I don't know what to think. Um... So, in the previous Metal Gear Solids, there were... Okay, we'll think about this in a bit. They have the same shoulder piece. Alright, that's definitely the end. Yeah, um, in the previous Metal Gear Solids, I mean, it's not as open world. This is what this game was focusing on, which is an amazing concept. I love the gameplay, I love going from camp to camp, stealing people, going back, uh, and sending them back to Mother Base to work for me. That concept is amazing. Uh, this game is definitely a really good game, but Metal Gear Solid has always been about. Like extremely long cutscenes, uh, complicated storylines, and the most important thing to me would be the very creative, uh, very creative boss fights. And this game lacked creative boss fights, and uh, that part was a little bit disappointing to me, but. I mean, overall, I gotta give- this game is one of the best games I've played, to be honest. It's just, it's- everything is so well put together, there's so much customizability, um, you, you can go around with different kinds of buddies, you can go lethal, non-lethal, there's so many ways to play this game, and I love that aspect of the game. And um, you know what, Metal Gear Solid 5 is probably not 
my favorite Metal Gear Solid game, it's probably going to still be Metal Gear Solid 3, Metal Gear Solid 5. If I were to rank them, it'd probably be like 1, um, and then Metal Gear Solid 1, Metal, or Metal Gear Solid 3, Metal Gear Solid 1, 4, and then 2 and 5 are, I think are about the same. So. <laughs> Uh, there, there's definitely going to be more Metal Gear Solid 5. I don't think this is the end. Uh, we're still unlocking people, so I, I wonder. And we don't have S plus plus, so. I won't Hang on, what is this? To the heartless sea. I won't see you in those ashes. You're all diamonds. Oh, what the this heck? Man acted as accomplice to the attack on Mother Base. Why are you here? Revenge against the boss. I'm not like you! I think it is time you knew. I'll go alone. Boss, what are you... We can't afford to lose anyone else. What if she's a spy? What if I'm a spy? Are you? Kill her! Kill her. Kill what should we do, boss? Just give the order. You're right. He is not one of us. Boss. Snake? Huz? <laughs> this looks so much better than what we've been playing! Wait. I think there's still more Metal Gear to be played. Attention! Yes. Diamond Dogs! Even with Skullface dead, our brothers are unavenged. Yeah. And the phantom pain he brought us lives on. Yeah. Cypher is still out there. We know they've planted spies, parasites among us. Watch the man to your left, to your right. Assume nothing, report everything. It's the only way to protect ourselves. From here on out! Those are cool sunglasses. You! Will be my eyes! The deadly oh, enemy's right now? here in our midst! And they will get no mercy. Okay, so I've done a quick search on how many missions there are in Metal Gear Solid 5 The Phantom Pain, and it looks like there are Chapter 2 missions to be completed in this one, but there are a bunch of um, harder missions scattered within this, this story list. So what I'm going to do is give you all the story missions that are relevant to the main story of the game and then I'll just complete these other ones by myself so uh, we won't go through the same missions again so it looks like the next episode will be to know too much and we'll continue with the chapter 2 missions I believe this is just chapter 2 missions but before we do that um, I hear that quiet does more stuff with you if you keep going back to Mother Base, so I'm gonna go back to Mother Base. If nothing happens, then we'll end the chap end the 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 episode here. But if there's a cutscene, we'll enjoy it and then uh, <laughs> or watch it and then and then um, we'll go on to the next episode later. Ah, right, here we go. Another cutscene. What's wrong with these kids? What do they want to see? Some things can't be helped. 
Is it Eli? Back to your quarters. What's going on? Shabani. Mayaka Nine Kingoya. Shabani. It's down there. Hey, the tank at the bottom is filled with chlorine disinfectant. One whiff and you'll suffocate. Don't even. How could you let it fall down there anyway? Man, this kid's creepy. Well, at least by the time we get it, the necklace is gonna be really clean. to recover the body. Wow. Quite a nice girl. Rest in peace. What kind of stunt was that? Trying to panic us. Oh, that was that was kind of awesome. Alright, that's all the time I have for this episode. Thank you for stopping by, playing some Metal Gear Solid 5 The Phantom Pain with me. And tune in to the next episode. We'll, con we'll continue Chapter 2. This game's not over yet. I was super disappointed after this uh, Sahelanthropist, Sahelanthropist boss fight. But there's a lot more to be played. So I wonder if we'll get to do more boss fights. Because that's what I think Metal Gear, the Metal Gear franchise is all about is really fun boss fights and Sahelanthropus was definitely very fun so uh, uh, thank you guys for so much for your time staying with me and playing some Metal Gear Solid 5 The Phantom Pain and until next time I'll see you guys later thank you bye bye